Tonight I'll be using Motherfucker, the Cremo V-Long horsehair brush, and got a blade here that uh, I worked on last weekend. This is a Shubudani slurry edge on one of my JR Tories, so stay tuned. I'm a lot more careful now <clears throat> when I shave since I cut my face that one time. Don't need another scar, but it'll fade with time, I'm sure. One thing I've learned over the past, past bleh, bleh, it's so early. Over the past few weeks, at least this is my thoughts, anyways, is that uh, skin is harder to cut than hair. Oh, man, this is a nice edge. So that's why when you get a super sharp edge for some people, it uh, gives you an irritated shave. Because you're cutting the hair and the skin. So there's a sweet spot where you just cut the hair and leave the skin. I have some sensitive skin, so those hyper sharp lightsaber edges. They can leave me irritated. I suppose some of y'all have a little better skin or different skin you can take take them but not me so uh i've i've learned that at least my my experience over the last few shaves is that i use a little bit of slurry it calms that edge down it gets me to that sweet spot where i'm cutting hair and i'm not cutting skin I think everybody has that spot somewhere. Mm. Already did that pass. Just feels incredible. I think even my cauticles, they kind of produce an edge that's just, just crossing that line. So, my next experiment 
is to uh, finish with a little bit of slurry on the cuticle. See what that does. Good slick soap. It's got a kind of a cologne smell to it. But not too strong. It's a tallow soap. The lather itself kind of reminds me of Chella. Except it has clay in it, so a little more slick. I don't feel a trace of irritation right now. So, if I finish on the J nat with water, it doesn't agree with my skin. If I go to town on an Arkansas edge, it really doesn't. Cause those get the razor hella sharp. I think the Arkansas edge is the sharpest. I've got an antique Thuringian coming in the mail here in a few days. Got an Escher slurry stone from Keith Johnson. And uh, I got some more experimenting to do there. I'm just gonna leave it right there because it feels pretty good. And I'm gonna go to my go-to, Pinon Clubman. Love the scent of this stuff. And that's it. Have a good one. Bye-bye.